recording our video. Here we are in Bay Meadows. We're going to Starbucks. Yep, going to Starbucks. First stop. Nowhere else. Starbucks. All right, here we are at Starbucks on Bay Meadows in 95. There's a really long drive through line. So I ordered on the app and Brian's gonna go in and get everything for us now. So basically, I just got off work. I am a disgusting mess. Disgusting. We have a long drive ahead of us, but it's better than me going home um, and getting ready again and then going on the drive we just needed to get right on the highway and i can clean up at the hotel but i am a disgusting mess right now and we're going on a road trip so this is the start i worked a shift this morning um here he comes okay There's a husky? Where? In the drive-thru right there. Where? Show me point. <gasps> Let me zoom in on him. Zoom in right there. Oh! I saw the husky. All right, so what'd you get? Uh, that's a cold brew with uh, some light cream and some uh, cold foam on top. Cool. And I got a venti ice latte. The cold foam looks awesome. And then we both got the, what is it called? Turkey bacon, turkey bacon cheddar? Here, let me take a video of yours. Don't like that. Yeah, tur turkey bacon cheddar. All right, this is the official start of the road trip. It's Halloween weekend. I'm so <clears throat> excited, are you excited? Florida Georgia weekend too. Yeah, it's gonna be crazy. Okay, here we go. How was that Starbucks inside? I've never been to this one. Good? Kind of big inside, but cool. Like, not enough chairs or something. Oh, okay. Looks nice. Mm hmm. Arby's, we must be on the highway. Wow, here's the city. We can't even see it. The big city, the big city's coming up. Oh my goodness, it's so foggy. It's a Halloween kind of weekend, isn't it? It's a mugger fucker. Oh my goodness. Yeah, it's, it's humid and cool and so foggy. Can't believe this is downtown Jacksonville. Have we ever seen it like this? I don't know. I don't think so. You don't? No. It's pretty. Yep, the big game, the big game. The big game, the big game. Hey, Special there's event. news for Jax. I never noticed that. Yeah, that's where that tower is. Special event, downtown. What's downtown? The big game. That's where it's at? Well, it's at the stadium. <laughs> yeah. oh, I didn't know it was even here. I just thought it was like in Georgia or something. It's always held at the... At the Jaguars? The Orange Bowl or what they used to call it. Oh, wow. Bowl. Okay, so that's why there's all the, these cops every two feet t timing everybody. Yeah, the big, big wow. Game. Oh, now I gotta edit you out. <laughs> I don't know how to do that. <laughs> I don't, I'm not that technological yet. Oh. Uh. Lake City, Savannah. Now we're crossing the river. Here's Baptist. And there's the river. Mm -hmm. there's, Coast Bridge is yeah, open. look at it. Right now. This is where there's lots of dolphins swimming in here. Lots of dolphins. Porpoises. Yeah, so, okay, so it's the Florida Georgia game. And is it a once a year thing? Probably. You can tell how much I know about this. Hey, there's Morgan and Morgan. We're here for you. For the people. Yeah. Big game. Got the big game. <laughs> big game. What's that from? Oh, uh, uh, planes, trains, and automobiles. Catch that game? <laughs> Got the 
the gate. There goes the city. Okay, entering Osceola National Forest. Okay, bears. Did you see the sign back there? For the bears? Yeah. Uh -huh. It said bears next 30 miles. I like driving this part. It's just all forest. Those trees, pretty trees. They all look like Christmas trees. And they're the Southern little ones. Ones. <laughs> yeah, look at there's like baby ones right in there, right yeah. on the line. The logging people must cut them down. Oh, yeah, I see a whole line. A section of field and then here is wow, they're growing. Yeah, I can see the little baby pines, oh, little baby gators. It's so pretty. All right, so we're taking this all the way to Mobile. Mobile. Going to Alabama. Ala freaking Bama. All right, we made it to our first stop. So how far did we drive? 181 miles so far, I think. It's a Harley Davidson. 181 miles? Well, probably a lot shorter than, yeah, maybe, yeah, since I left home, I think. Okay. Oh, Dairy Queen, you can get us some Dairy Queen. Yeah, for a little chill. <laughs> and and uh, Waffle House. All right, so we're stopping our first stop. No, our second stop. Starbucks was our first stop. We're going to McDonald's for lunch. So how many hours have we been in the car? No. Okay, so here we are at McDonald's, uh, past Lake City, and we're stopping for some lunch. It's freezing outside, very cold, uh, probably in, 60s or 70s it feels like you know 20 degrees to me but um we're gonna get some lunch all right here we are at mickey d's and we've got three hours 26 minutes 246 miles and yeah 246 miles three hours 26 minutes so we got nuggets fries and a cup of ice for my bubbly and it's chilly how much would you say the temperature is i thought it was in the 60s or 70s what do you think 70 70 it's 70 okay so i was right there and wow and our mcdonald's is um hot it's actually hot <laughs> i got a bonus one you did look at that bonus chicken oh well, that's interesting. I've never seen one shaped that way. Wow. Yeah, it's pretty. So this is it, right? These are the hills. The hills of the Panhandle. So you said this is the hilliest part of the whole state? Yep. Are there caves? Oh yeah. Tunnel, Look time. at these pretty cave or pretty uh, hills. So there was a railroad tunnel, but there isn't one now. No, the line's probably a man long abandoned. What did they do with it? Look at the colors; they're so pretty. What do you mean? With the tunnel. I, I don't know if it's collapsed in or if it. Uh... This is as it's funny because there's no hurricane, but this is how I remember this route. You know, hardly any cars on it. it must always be like this. Except when we're on our way back from the hurricane. Yeah, no, that. yeah, never mind. Yeah, oh my god. It's very pretty here. Pretty fall colors mixed in. I like these pine trees so much. What are we going over? I don't know. There was a historic sign or something. I know. I don't know what it said. We're high in the sky, like in Louisiana. Does it look like we're going over a swamp? I can't tell. I think so. It's a swamp. Let's see what the sign says. It looks like a river. Entry. Oh, 
there we go. During the central time zone. Whoa, we gained an hour? We gained an hour. It's only 1.36. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah. It said entering Jackson County. Is that what it said? Some kind of county, yeah. There's some baby pine trees. Yeah, baby pines. Baby pines. So what, any other big city we have to go through right now? Just Mobile. Just, just Mobile. So we're not going to see Destin today. No. Because Destin is off the highway south of the road we're on? Uh-huh. Okay. I mean, Pensacola. Okay. Are we going to go through Pensacola? I don't know if we go through Pensacola. Okay, that's Are we going to see Gulf Shores, Alabama? No, we don't go through that either. Because that's south of where we're going, right? Uh -huh. Okay. Well, this technically could be our last stop, right? Mm-hmm. We're in what town? The Pontiac Springs or something. Oh, yeah, else. defunct, right? <laughs> I don't know how to say it. Defunct Springs, that's a pretty tree. All right, so we just got gas, and we've got it. one hour, 57 minutes, 133 miles left to our destination. Yeah, once we get to uh, Mobile, you'll have to... Turn off the directions? Yes, yeah, so yeah. Mm. Onward toward Pensacola. Okay, so we have about an hour and a half left. What did uh, you say? Less than, less than two hours. Less than two hours? Okay. So, one horse day. We're going Florida to Alabama. Okay. So, yeah, before we went any further, I figured I should explain the whole <laughs> the whole uh, reason for the video. So, which I didn't, right? <laughs> right? No, I didn't. Okay, so I um, so you dropped me off at work this morning, very early at 7:15, and then you picked me up at 10:15, 10:45, and we went straight on the road, so we were all packed as of last night. And you were, did you have to pack early this morning, or were you already packed? Well, my clothes was packed, but um, I had to pack everything else. Yeah, okay. And you said you didn't pack for cold weather. Right. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Um, maybe we'll be at some tourist gift shop, huh? Maybe. Depends how cold Destin's gonna be. Yeah, so we are driving. What was our total mileage for today? Do you remember or no? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe 400 something. Um, okay, so we're driving from Jacksonville, Florida to Mobile, Alabama. Basically, the same exact route we drove for Hurricane Irma in 2017. Um, and there's about the same amount of people on the road that there was in 2017. Just a little bit more. <laughs> um, so that's that's basically it. I am. This is uh, the video is the video that I'm making today is a two part video, and so this is road trip part one, and tomorrow is part two. Um, they're completely different topics. Today is just driving to our destination. There's really 
knock on wood, nothing exciting happening. Yeah, so would you say we got no real plans today other than getting to Mobile and getting to our hotel? No, no plans, right? Not even like dinner. We're just gonna get to the room, get dinner in the hotel, chill out. Plus, because I work, so I have to get cleaned up from being a mess. Um, so we're not going out anywhere. We're staying at a Homewood Suites. Homewood Suites. Which is the one with the like the little room bedroom and the separate little kitchen area. And um, but yeah, there's hopefully nothing at all exciting happening other than seeing the trees go by and and drive hundreds of miles and a few rest stops and get some food. Um, and then tomorrow I'm going to film a second video. If this, if this video has intrigued you enough to stay <laughs> for part two, part two is going to be very different than part one, but I did want to make this as a two part video because there's a reason for part one and part two and it's a story and it all ties together and, um, wouldn't you say? Do you have mm -hmm. any input on that? No, you sound sounds pretty good. <laughs> right? Am I missing anything? I don't think so. Okay. And should I clarify, because we have not talked about this on camera, that um, um, that our Madeline is no longer with us? So okay. Whatever you feel like you want to. Well, talk yeah. About. So I feel like we should say that and tell you that our Madeline is in heaven, and so that's why it's just Brian and I right now in the video because normally I would have a little Sheltie right here in my lap or right back there or by you, but she's in heaven. So it's just Brian and I. And so it's really well. No, I guess we've had a few road trips without her, huh? So we far, went but Chicago. we went up to Chicago. Went down to Disney one time. Yeah, went to Disney twice. We went out to Orlando without her. Oh my goodness. Okay, so yeah, our baby Sheltie is in heaven with God, and it's just Brian and I. So, um very hard, very sad. It's hard to even think about, but um, we're basically, basically I'm just uh, listening to God right now every day because God is guiding us this way. So um, it's very sad, but she is in heaven with God. And so it's all I can grateful that she's not in any pain um but so yeah that's why it's just Brian and I and tomorrow we have a completely different type of video for you so that's why it's called part one and part two because it all ties together <laughs> and right now we're just gonna head towards the hotel and we'll see what Mobile looks like because I don't remember does it have a skyline? Is it a big town? There's a little skyline. There is? Yeah. I don't remember it. Did we go in the city? No. I mean, the last time you and I went, yeah. my spring break, when we drove from New Orleans to Panama City or Gulf Shores. Okay. I don't remember that at all. That was about <laughs> 25 years ago? <laughs> yeah, I don't remember at all. So, <laughs> should be interesting, but... Yeah, we have no plans. Nothing exciting happening. Do you think we'll have to stop one more time or no? No, I think we'll be able to tell us. Yay! Okay, I, yeah, I hope so. I don't really want to be in the car too much longer. But it's a nice, pretty drive. It really is, wouldn't you say? Especially this time of year, I like the leaves. Yeah, this is a much more calming drive than like going to Atlanta or something. Oh my gosh, yeah, it's very, very peaceful. And the sky hasn't changed once, <laughs> which is rare. It's very overcast. 
Nothing, nothing exciting happening. This is it. <laughs> this is it, baby. All right, what are we crossing here? Some sort of river or something. Yeah, which one? <sighs> which one? I missed the sign. I don't know. I don't know. I missed it. Oh, okay. All right, here we come. Over. What's the name? Bay, Bay of Mobile? Mobile no, Bay? What is it? We're not? Oh, it's big. But is it, what are we crossing? A river? A it's bay? Gonna be a bay. <laughs> okay. Wow, it's big. So, what is the Mobile Bay called? The Bay of Mobile? Mm -hmm. Wow. I wonder what that is all the way in the corner over there. Oh, really? Are we right by Pensacola? It's an interesting railroad bridge. So, okay, so the sign that we just saw about the winds, that was for this. Yeah. So we just passed the sign and it said, caution, high winds on the bridge. What did it say? Something like that? Mm -hmm. Beware of high winds on this bridge. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're nowhere near Mobile yet. We got 70 more miles. So, yeah, 63 miles. Okay. It's pretty big. So is the bay in Mobile even bigger? Yeah, I, I almost remember it like we had a tunnel to go under or something. We'll find out. Oh, wow. Once we get closer, you'll turn on the Google thing. Okay. Yeah, still got 60 miles. For yeah, I have the Google Maps on. And CSX, does that sound right? Mm -hmm. Oh, I was right. Uh -huh. oh. Alright, I'm gonna get this. <laughs> there it is. Yeah, goodbye, Florida. Thank you for visiting. Thank you for visiting. There we go. Alright, we're in Alabama State Line. Right now. So now how many miles do we have? We're just driving and driving. How many miles? Sweet home Alabama. Oh, wow. Look at that. How many miles? I don't know. I don't know either. Got colder again. 
So yeah, there's Mobile. Now, when we were here for Irma, we did not cross this. No. Okay, that's what I thought. So I don't remember this. I think you basically stayed in the hotel the entire time. Yeah. Yes. Except, wow. no, one time you did go for a walk with me. To the yeah, where did I go?
We are going in a tunnel. Oh my God. Are we, don't tell me we're going underwater. Looks like it. Oh my, oh my. Oh my God, we're going so. Oh my God, I'm freaking out. Oh my God, we are going so low. <gasps> there's, there's light. Holy cow. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I don't see something like this every day. I'm glad this isn't my commute. I wouldn't be able to go to work. That's really freaky. Oh, now it's raining. Oh, it, oh, here's the Superdome. All right, so where's that battleship? It's gone. Be... Gone? Yeah, we're in. No, there it's right there. Is that it? There it is. Is that it? Oh, it's a shipbuilding company. Oh, I have no idea. Okay, yeah, I'll find the Miss Google. Okay. All right, here's our hotel for the night. Which one? The left or the right? Oh, okay. <laughs> it says Homewood Suites, right? Right on the highway. Yep. Right on the highway. Here's our hotel. And it's raining. I don't know, but we're by a Krispy Kreme donut truck really bad weather donut truck maybe we get free donuts for staying here decorated for Halloween mm -hmm. oh. well, decorated for Halloween. cool oh. look at the kitty cute oh, okay. Oh my gosh. Wow, they really know how to sell her. <laughs> oh my gosh. Bring the whole family. It's pet friendly. Mm -hmm. Aww. Does our uh, thing face this way or the other way? Uh, cool. What's our room number? Did it say that before? I didn't even notice the TV on. When Welcome, Brian. Oh. Wow, here we are. Oh my gosh, this is nice. Wow. Okay, we, gotta, we can make our ramen soup. Oh, soup. I should have brought some ramen. <laughs> my favorite light in the house is always the microwave light. Wow, oh my God. Oh, I can have some cold drink. Wow, this is so nice. Okay, so where do we face? Oh, this is really nice. Madeline loves her hotel rooms. Cool. Cutting green and some. Oh, oh my goodness, yeah. That's cute. And then the highway. Which highway? I-65. I-65, right? Okay. Nice. Some, what do you call it? What is that? Connect 4? No, what is that game? Right there. Yeah, I think this is, is that what it is? Oh my goodness. Wow. Oh, it's very nice. Let's see. Let's see. I gotta take my shoes off. I don't want to walk in there with my dirty shoes. It's already dark out. Well, it got dark real fast. Let's see if I can see Brian. It's raining and it's so cold and we've been getting notifications about t tornado warning. And now we just got a huge, one of those loud, crazy hazard sounding um, notifications to our phone saying we're in a tornado warning. Brian's going to get our dinner, we ordered Chinese, and we're on the top floor 
of a wood framed building. So I guess the place to be. Um, but Brian checked the radar. He doesn't think there's a tornado. Uh, I mean, he doesn't see anything bad on the radar, but uh, are you serious? I-65? In five minutes? In four minutes. There's supposed to be a tornado right here. Well, I'm glad you didn't go then. But how do they know? They can't predict a tornado. They can predict conditions for a tornado, but a tornado... So you... Oh! Lightning. So you think um, there are water spouts off the bay? Like on, like in the ocean? Yeah, because it's, uh, it's not heavy rain or anything. Whoa! Did you hear that? Madeline is not happy about the funders. I can't, I can't believe this. We're on the top floor of a building. You're not supposed to be on a high floor. And the only other place we have is our car. And you're not supposed to be in the car either. Well, I'm glad you came back from getting the food. This is ridiculous. All right. Well, Brian left again. Uh, they keep delaying the... <laughs> or extending the warning. So... Um, I don't know. No one out here seems to be too scared, but they freaked me the heck out. That phone doing that. So let's see if we can see Brian leaving here. But it is really raining. It's pouring. It's hard to tell. Um, but it's pouring. I can't believe we have a tornado warning right now. I really can't. Let's see where Brian is. Where is he? Oh, somebody's coming in with an umbrella. There goes our car. Oh, I see Brian running. I don't think the car. I don't think the video capturing it. But Brian is running to the car in the rain. There he goes. Okay. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. I think it's pouring. Yeah, we, we drove all the way to Mobile, Alabama, and all we got is this nice view of the highway. <laughs> I'm just joking. I like actually being on the highways. I love these kind of road trips. Okay, bye-bye. Can you see me? <laughs> Waving. <laughs> there he goes. 2.2 miles to the Chinese place in the storm. Okay, so oh, Brian's out getting the dinner and I showered. I all relaxed in this wonderful hotel room. It's really nice. I sat down on the bed with my laptop to edit today's video. So, so waiting for dinner and I'm gonna watch hopefully some forensic files. Um, God is playing a trick on me tonight because forensic files isn't on right now and it's my favorite show. So all I need is some forensic files and Chinese food, but Brian will be home soon. Um, other than that, it, this is a really nice comfortable hotel room and I feel so much better that I'm out of the car and I'm excited to take you with us tomorrow. Whoa! Yeah, okay, it's really pouring now. Even more so. Um, yeah, so I'm really, really excited about taking you guys with tomorrow for the other half of our adventure. Oh my. So, let's see when Brian gets back with dinner. I really hope there's no tornado. Other than this warning, this would not be a big deal to me at all. I am, uh, I am used to these kind of storms for the past, you know, five, six years living down here. Um, but the tornado warnings, not so much. Uh, I can deal with the hurricanes more so because uh, they're a little, obviously way more uh, predictable. So kind of freaked out right now. Brian said if there was a tornado, it would be coming from this way. So every sound that is happening outside is freaking me out right now. Probably only because we're on the top floor of a building. But yeah, I'm pretty much used to the 
storms, all the wild tropical storms down here. And yeah, the water spouts off the ocean, that's one thing, but yeah, on land, okay, forget about it. So the TV just stopped working and the rain is pounding harder against the walls of the building and it was really loud. But it looks okay out here. Hopefully Brian gets back soon. Is this him? No. Um, but yeah, the satellite TV stopped working. Or whatever it is. It just froze. There's Brian. Good. All right, he made it back. That's... At least I think that's our car, and he's pulling in the same spot. It must be him. <gasps> and the TV started working. All right. Good. Here he comes. So I'm just waiting here for Brian, and we're going to eat dinner, and I'm just going to relax. I am going to watch TV and relax, and I'm not even going to worry about editing this video and getting it out home. Um, but today is a good day. Today, uh, I wanted to film for, um, for reasons you will see tomorrow on the next video. So anyways, um, we're going to eat dinner now and I'm so glad you guys could come along with me today and I'm excited about sharing the journey with you tomorrow for what we're doing tomorrow. Thank you for joining me today on this very long day. Um, it's been a long day. We've done a lot. I worked, Brian dropped me off at work. I, actually, I woke up at 1.56 a.m., couldn't sleep. I was up from 1.56 to at least 4.56 fell back to sleep for a little bit and got up at 5.30. So it was a brutal night. Then I had to work, then Brian picked me up, then we went on this road trip and now we're here and the tornado warning and all that. So I'm just, it's been a long day, but thank you for joining us because I filmed today even though there was nothing exciting. What, the most exciting thing that happened today was, it was actually pretty exciting. I'd never seen a tunnel like that. I don't remember that. Um, so yeah, that was really cool. I would say that was the most interesting thing that happened today, but thanks for joining us. We'll see you tomorrow. And um, I'm Christine Piper, and you're watching Christine's Floridian Dreams. And these are my dreams. If you've got dreams, it's up to you to make them come true and no one else. Bye. Good night, you all. Good night, Madeline. Mama and Brian love you so much with all our hearts. I love you, baby girl. Hello. Are you having your little nap? Yes. Oh, what a nice little girl.